Greetings, cat enthusiasts. Today, we have a topic that was personally very intriguing for me, and I hope it will be equally fascinating for you. I love space, and I love cats. And this video is about a cat in space. Many know that monkeys and dogs have been to space, but few are aware that a cat also journeyed into space. On October 18, 1963, France sent the first cat named Felicet into space aboard the Veronique rocket. Prior to this, the same rocket had already successfully traveled beyond Earth's boundaries with rats on board. In the early 1960s, French scientists began preparing a mammal with a more complex brain for space travel. Since local biologists had extensively studied the structure of a cat's brain, they decided to choose them for this purpose. Initially, there were 14 cats in the space team. Scientists immediately excluded male cats from the program due to their higher anxiety levels, which is an interesting fact worth noting. Female cats turned out to be calmer, leading to the exclusion of all male cats from the program. So, if you seek tranquility, consider adopting a female cat. Now, let's return to the first cat's journey to space. The best four-legged cosmonauts were trained like humans. Cats underwent an intensive training program that taught them to tolerate noise and vibrations, stay calmly in a box, and rotate in a centrifuge. Electrodes were implanted in their brains to monitor their activity, as the primary scientific objective was to understand how space travel affects the brain. Following the preparation, four primary contenders were selected, while one cat had a malfunctioning electrode right from the beginning. She was left to live in the laboratory as a mascot. Interestingly, only this cat received a name, Scooby-Doo. The others were forbidden names and were simply numbered. This was done so that the laboratory scientists wouldn't become attached to them and wouldn't select a cat for flight against the results. Ultimately, on launch day, the favorite for the flight was the two-colored cat C-341. She was not only the most balanced but also the lightest. Other team members had gained too much weight. By the way, according to some contemporary studies, black and white cats are the calmest and most patient. So here's another piece of information for you. If you are looking for a calm feline companion, consider choosing a cat of such coloring. The little cat was wrapped in wires, placed in a special cat-sized space chair, and launched toward the stars from the first French spaceport in Algeria. The flight lasted only 13 minutes, during which the cat experienced five minutes of weightlessness at an altitude of 152 kilometers. The capsule with the cat landed safely on Earth via parachute. The cat was retrieved outside, alive but quite bewildered. After the successful return, scientists finally named her, Felicet, in honor of the cat Felix from a silent film, which had a similar coloring. Felicet immediately became a national heroine. Postcards and posters featuring her were released. However, Felicet's story ended rather sadly. Two months after her return, French scientists euthanized the spacefaring cat to study changes in her brain in detail. On October 24 of the same year, four days later, the French launched another cat, but she returned dead after a two-day delay in space. Her name is still not disclosed. By the way, it was Felicet who initiated the first wave of protests against space programs involving animals. So, one could say that this little cat not only elevated French space exploration but also human ethics. Nonetheless, against the backdrop of humanity's other space achievements in the early 1960s, her name was forgotten. The story of the first space cat survives only in archives. In 2017, an Englishman uncovered this story and initiated fundraising for a monument to Felicet. He managed to gather the required amount in just a few months. Currently, the monument stands in front of the International Space Institute in France. Hooray for the furry heroine! I hope you've learned something new from this video and found it interesting. I would appreciate it if you could like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.